Okay, so John Cartmel again, and we're back at Remedy Notes, and uh, we're on the page that you get to once you've requested a demo version and you've responded to the email saying, yes, I do want it. And what we're going to do now is look at um, getting ourselves a copy of Remedy Notes that will work on a PC. So we click on the PC version button, and that takes us into um, Internet Explorer in this case, but whatever your browser is, and it says, do you want to open or save the file? So what we'll do, we'll, we'll save it. And uh, so now, here we go, it's going to ask us where to save this. So we'll, we'll pop it onto the desktop, and we'll save it there. And now we're in for the long haul. Um, the uh, the broadband here is very very slow, so uh, it's estimated it's going to take about six or seven minutes. Um, so what I'll do now is I'll pause and I'll come back um, when when we're a little bit closer to uh, having downloaded the file. Okay. So here we are, very very nearly at the the end, and. Uh, file is being copied into um, to the desktop. So uh, we just wait while that takes place. Lovely, good. So we'll open the file. And here we go. We've got through to this file which is Remedy Notes Installer. Click on here, and here we've got. First of all, we've got a, a README uh, message, so we'll just open that up, and this will just give a little bit of information about what you're going to need to do in order to install um, uh, Remedy Notes onto your PC. So here's that. PDF document basically just setting out what it is that we're going to need to do. Okay, lovely. I'm going to pause again. Fine, so coming back to here, we're now going to open the installer. So I'll just double click on that. And it, um, it says the application may depend on other compressed files in this folder. In this case, all we're going to do is run it. So we just click on run. Here we are with the, the setup wizard, and it says it will install Remedy Notes version 1.0, version v1, on your computer. That's what we want to do, so we'll click next. It asks if we'd like to have a, an icon on the desktop. Yep, that would be helpful, so let's do that. And then we click next again. It summarizes what it's going to do, and you say install. And now what it's doing is extracting all the files that it needs in order to set up Remedy Notes on your desktop. All right, then. Actually, that's not correct. To set it up in um, my documents, that particular folder. Fine, and it has quite a number of files that it needs to place all in the correct situation within <coughs> the Windows operating system. So we just let it get on with that. at the moment.
as you can see, is a large number of files that have to go in here in order to support this very simple package. just headed towards the end of what has actually been an amazingly <laughs> long process and I'm hoping that that's just because I'm working on a rather um, slow uh, uh, version of Windows. So here we've got that and it says do you want to launch Remedy Notes and yeah that would be very good so we'll just finish the installation and then we'll, we'll allow um, a little bit of time for the uh, for the program to start. And so now, here we are, and um, uh, Remedy Notes comes up with, with basically two things it needs from us. First of all, it's an account name, and the account name is always going to be user, and then the password. So initially, the password is password. So P A S S W O R D, and then I'm going to click on OK and then what it says is well passwords not particularly secure password so enter a new password of your own devising so I'm going to put in a, a new password and then I'm going to repeat exactly the same thing where it says confirm the new password so I click on OK and now to see Remedy Notes appearing and the first thing that we get to look at here is if I can just manipulate this is the license so here we've got the license information and I encourage you to have a good read of the license so that you are sure what it is that you are accepting and then when you're happy, you can click on Accept. And that then takes us through to a welcome page. And the welcome page basically says, here you are, you're using this in demo mode, a free trial, and the free trial lasts between the start date and the end date. So you get 28 days and then here you've got this tempting little button saying purchase. But before we purchase, the obvious thing to do is to go and have a look and see what Remedy Notes is all about. So you can start off by clicking on this little button up here and you can start having a look at what you've got in the way of information um, relating to remedies. And what I'll do, I'll just see whether I can um, fit more of this uh, screen into this uh, sort of like narrow box that I've got here. Okay, so this is this is Remedy Notes and uh, well what, what, what you can do now is begin to play around in here and see what you make of it. So I hope this video has been useful. All the very best to you. Bye bye.